Rewards credit cards can mean extra value for some as long as you find out up front about any fees or strings when it comes to using your rewards. Some people aren't interested, though, especially one viewer who is being charged for an account that she didn't want. She called 2 News Problem Solver Pete Knutson for help. Come on, here. Why? What's the matter? Hmm? Meet Pretty Boy, Dorothy's pet parakeet. He keeps her company and entertained, even when a financial problem with the rewards credit card company wasn't so pretty. Well, it was kind of stressful, and I wasn't having a very good time at it. It started when Dorothy ordered clothes from the Blair Company catalog, just like she's done for years. This time, though, she was asked something different at the end of her phone order. She said, would you like to have a Blair reward card? And I said, no. Still, a few days later, she got a statement from Blair charging a $15 monthly service fee for the account. Dorothy says she called the company several times to say she didn't order the card or want it. And they said, well, we'll take care of it. Well, they didn't. So I wrote a letter. But Dorothy kept getting bills with that same $15 monthly service charge. Plus now, there were $25 late fees every month and 27% interest for not paying. It wasn't long until she owed nearly $190. Like Pretty Boy, Dorothy says she felt caged in, getting a lot of collection calls and letters. Her account was eventually reported to the credit bureaus. Yeah, it was bugging me because I, I knew that they it shouldn't be there because I didn't order the card. Dorothy finally called the two news problem solvers, and we got in touch with Blair. A representative researched Dorothy's situation. It wasn't long until Blair told us they were not holding her responsible for the account, were stopping collections, and would correct Dorothy's credit report. It takes a lot off of my mind. It, it lets you lay down and go to sleep at night. As long as Pretty Boy doesn't talk too much and keep her awake. Pete Knutson, 2 News works for you.